The real control power and flexibility of the GX13 comes from its use with a specially modified Roland GM70. This GM70 has been modified to accept a 7-pin controller cable from the GX13 and has the latest revision 1.02 operating system EEPROM chips. Important note, if you are using the GX13 GM70 combination with a 13-pin synth, be sure to turn the synth volume adjust to around the 2 o'clock position before turning on the 13-pin synth. You'll notice that there's a label on the top of the GX13 to give you a recommended range to set the control knob to. The operating voltage of the GM70 is twice that of a 13-pin synth. If the 13-pin synth receives a synth control voltage that exceeds its internal level, the 13-pin synth will mute its output or not work correctly. In the case of the Roland GR55, you may hear a low frequency thump from the audio outputs. In this case, reduce the synth volume adjust level and it should work just fine. A table has been attached to the top of the modified GM70 to spell out the control voltage sources of a vintage Roland or Ibanez guitar synth controller. On the GM70, the control assigns are global. Once you set the control assigns, they are the same for every GM70 patch and there's no need to hit ride or to store these changes. Once you make a change, it's automatically effective. This is a good thing since successful use of the GM70 depends on matching control voltage signals to MIDI controller signals and then on the Roland GR55 matching those MIDI controller inputs to a control destination. By keeping the control voltage to MIDI assignments constant, we have one less variable to keep in mind when programming the GR55. Here's a quick reminder of the control voltage assignments in vintage Roland guitars. CV1 is filter cutoff. CV2 is resonance. On the G707 guitar, this knob is labeled as edit. CV3 is not used. And CV4 is modulation or LFO depth. On the Ibanez IMG2010, these sources are labeled as CV1 sensitivity, CV2 velocity, CV3 control arm or the virtual whammy bar, CV4 control change. The GM70 is a really powerful MIDI processor. In addition to the four control voltages generated by the guitar, you can expand the GM70 with three additional foot switches, two EV5 expression pedals, plus the ability to send MIDI program changes.